Are you going to tell us a story, Maisie? Oh, yes, please, Maisie. Please tell us the one you wrote about how the jumbles began. Oh, yes, that's really cool. OK. Are you sitting comfortably? Then I'll begin. Once upon a time, there was a little girl who loved telling stories about snakes that talked and caterpillars that danced. But everyone just smiled and said, That's nice, dear. She told stories about spiders that spun webs of lollipops. But everyone just smiled and said, That's nice, dear. One of her favourite stories was about Maisie, her special friend, who liked hanging on the curtain poles. But everyone just smiled and said, That's nice, dear. One day, she looked in her jumble box and chose some old pink tights, a ball of black wool and an old pillowcase with lots of fluffy stuffing. She stuffed and tied and stuffed and tied and quite soon there was just the face and hair to finish and she had made the very first jumble. I'll call you Maisie Jumble, she said, because you are made from jumble. And everyone just smiled and said, That's a good idea. That night, she went to bed with lots of stories in her head. Jumble stories. But strange things happened that night. And in the morning light, there were two jumbles. Quite soon, there were jumbles everywhere. Hanging from the curtains, tumbling down the stairs. Oh dear, she said, my jumbles need a new house. And everyone smiled and said, that's a good idea. So, off into the woods they went and found the perfect house. But it was getting very late. Should they knock? But wait. The door was opening. Who was inside? It was a witch. A friendly witch. A funny witch. A dizzy Lizzy witch. Lizzy was lonely. She needed some friends. So the jumbles moved in. And that is the end of this story. But just the beginning of the jumbles and jumble fun. Oh, that was so nice, Maisie. I never get tired of hearing that story. It's really, really good. Yes, and that wasn't the end, was it? It was the beginning, because now there are so many 
jumbles. Yes, and we are two of the newest ones, aren't we, Tutu? Yes, we are, Alfie. And look, here are some of the others. Here's Spotty. He wants to be an astronaut. And there's Lorenzo. And here's Lulu, who's always tumbling around and climbing. And here's Freddy, who always helps you to think things out yourself. Yes, and then there's the little girl herself, isn't there, Tutu? Yes, there is. There's Judith Ann, and here she is. And she created all of us. Yes, but she's not a little girl anymore, is she? She's all grown up. Yes, Alfie, she is all grown up. But she still knows what we like and what is good for us. Oh, yes, she does. And that's why she likes us to make up our own stories and paint our own pictures and use our imagination and to really, really try and think things out for ourselves and be really creative. So that's all for now from the Jumbles and Jumble Fun. We hope you've really enjoyed our story and that you will be back very soon.